Day Book Book of the Year 2000 A Lesson in Cheering Yourself Up Bradley Trevor Grieve Random House Australia To my wonderful parents, Faye and Trevor Grieve, who never stopped taking me out to see the world, even after I was beaten by penguins twice. Bradley Trevor Grieve was born in Australia's silent state of Tasmania. He has been gainfully employed as an artist, cartoonist, furniture and toy designer, animation director, screenwriter and paratroop platoon commander. He currently lives in Sydney and divides much of his time between Los Angeles and New York. Acknowledgements There are so many incredible photographs in the Blue Day book that it's not possible to credit every single photographer in the space we have. But I would like to say that the magic in every image speaks of a talent and purpose that my clumsy prose could only diminish. What a wonderful breed of artists could squeeze so much into a fraction of a fraction of a moment. Thank you. A tiny book like this appears deceptively simple. It is not. I owe great thanks to the many people who encouraged me to pursue the project, particularly after the first five rejections. My adorable sisters, Lindley and Vanessa, led the charge along with my dear friends Basquales Camacci, Simone or Simon Reynolds, Imogen Banks, and... Jane Mallon. Special awards are due to Sue Greaves, Emma McClure and Norma Scott who let me invade their photo archives without flinching. And of course to my editor Christine Schillig and her team at Andrews McMill who turned a scribbly submission into this beautiful little book. I am particularly grateful to L. Zuckerman, my agent at Writer's House in New York, and his faithful and witty assistant, Faye Greenfield, for setting me loose in America. I also want to say a special thank you to marketing superstar Leslie Ferraro, who personally made up about one million for the copied submissions late one San Francisco summer night so that an impoverished Australian artist could have a shot at the big league. With friends like these, I cannot fail.